Hi, this is Dr. Ramin Tayani, ophthalmologist and oculoplastic surgeon at the Tayani Institute. Uh, today we're going to talk about eyelid lesions or really any lesions around the eyes that are cancerous. So this is a patient who's already had a lesion biopsied and it's turned out to be cancerous of usually basal cell or squamous cell in origin, not typically mo an, uh, a melanoma. So once we remove the, once we have the biopsy done and we have to make a decision how we're going to remove this. When we have skin cancer, we want to make sure that we remove it and we have something called clear margins. Clear margins means that the tumor cells are not going to the extent of the um, um, outside of what we've taken out. That way we have no tumor cells left behind. There are two ways of doing this, either by a Mohs technique, M-O-H-S, which is a person's name uh, who developed this, a dermatologist who developed this many years ago, or by a technique called a frozen section. So Mohs technique is done by the dermatologist. They remove the, t the, the tumor and then they refer the patient to me for closure if it's around the eye or facial area where they're not comfortable closing. And as an oculoplastic surgeon, I'm reconstructing the area. If there is no dermatologist involved with the removal, then I use, the surgeon uses, a technique called frozen section. We remove what we see clinically as the area of involvement. We send it off to a pathologist who looks under a microscope and tells us that we have clear margins. Once we have the clear margins, again, my job as an oculoplastic surgeon is to reconstruct the defect with the best cosmetic result and the most uh, functional outcome as well. The uh, procedure itself could take anywhere from 30 to 60 minutes for the removal and or longer until we have the clear margins. And then really the reconstruction of it is very, very wide. It depends on what areas involved, if it's the lower lid, upper lid, is it outside of the areas of the eyelid. So the, each one of those closures is really a um, different scenario. But if it's a simple closure of the eyelid, it could be as simple as just bringing the eyelid, the defect is taken out, the eyelid is brought back, simple closure. Or there are techniques that we use if it's a large amount of the eyelid removed, which we'll talk in a different video uh, called a Hughes graft, which where we borrow from the upper lid and close into the lower lid. Uh, again, we can come to that video called uh, removal of the eyelid tumor with the Hughes graft, tarsal conjunctival graft. Till next time, this is Dr. Ramin Tayani from the Tayani Institute. Have a great day.